Orange County is trying out the controversial COVID passport plan, which provides proof a person is vaccinated. Not everyone thinks it's a great idea. As Chris Wolf reports, some are concerned about privacy issues, fairness to low income residents and government overreach. Most of us have passports for travel and identification, but what about a passport for living? We're talking about a COVID-19 vaccine passport, a digital record of inoculation that a person could display through a smartphone. In the era of the coronavirus pandemic and recovery, this feature would allow easier access to restaurants, conferences, meetings, concerts, and sporting events, for example. The idea may soon become reality in a test run in Orange County. Using what's called quick response codes, the black and white square shaped codes you find on airline boarding passes or digital restaurant menus. There will only be an ID that nobody else have access to it except for the individual. And then it's your name and your birthday. That's it. It doesn't say anything. It doesn't give out your medical condition. It's just said that you've been vaccinated. But what about those who haven't yet been vaccinated or who don't have a smartphone or Internet access for this digital passport? There is talk of printing cards. However, officials warn those can be lost or forged. And there's some political controversy with critics claiming the system would violate personal freedom and privacy. The term passport has been controversial. Uh, we we'll probably won't use the term passports, but uh, uh, rather a vaccine verification. Chris Wolf reporting San Diego County leaders have not indicated whether they're looking at a similar test.